Let's go ahead and open them right here. Boom, it opens up very cool. Damn, like the, that got that dope Alma Manier like print on this. Definitely did, did their thing on the packaging. Hey man, say man, it's Armand Too Real in the cut on the mic. As you can see, and today we're gonna be talking about. Um, well, actually, I'm gonna be doing an unboxing on the Alma threes. So yes, sir, stay tuned for this video. Drop a like, drop a sub. Well, you know, yeah, stay tuned. I'm about to unbox it. Got the package right here. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna get straight into this unboxing. So let's go ahead and get straight into it. Drop a like, drop a sub, hit the notification bell. And yeah, let me take a sip of water real quick and let's get into it. All right, back. Got a knife. As you can see, my cat's right there. So yes, sir, she's in the cut. But yeah, let's go ahead and get into this unboxing. Um, this pair. I hit on social status. Yeah, I hit this pair on social status. So I won, I won a raffle. I already knew it was kind of fishy whenever I hit the EQL raffle because, as you know, EQL raffles are very rare to hit, especially like on a Travis or something like that, or like any like exclusive shoe, like a J Bob and 3 Rio or something like that. You know, it's just very hard to hit EQL. So whenever you hit EQL, just know it must not be that hard to get. So um, anyways, though, this pair was not hard to get at all, but I'm unboxing it. I can already kind of see it. So let me get unboxed. Okay, boom, looking into the package, I can already see the Alma box. It's like a special box, like it's definitely a cool box right here. This pair is like going for dumb cheap right now as I could see why, because it literally sat on Alma Almanier's website whenever it was drop day on the Alma website. It sold out on sneakers obviously because sneakers didn't have as much stock. Alma Almanier obviously had a bunch of stock of these, but this is a size, this is a woman's shoe. So um, it's a size 11 and a half woman, size 10 men. So if you want a size 10 men's, I know they weren't that hard to get, but if you are trying to get them, hit me up on Instagram. I'm on two bros, it's gonna be in the description down below. But yeah, this, po this box is super dope little jordan logo on it right here um nothing too crazy on the outside but let's go, go ahead and open it. it's like a trifold almost like it opens up like this i think yep opens like this so that's kind of dope boom okay um pretty dope it has like all my near logo right here it's kind of hard to show y'all i'll show y'all oh i don't know it's gonna it's gonna be a little bit hard to show y'all that but yeah pretty dope um boxing cool little um has a nike air logo jump man logo let's go ahead and open them right here Boom, it opens up very cool. Damn, like the, that got that dope Alma Manier like print on this. Definitely did, did their thing on the packaging on this. But let me take one more sip of water real quick. All right, bet, yeah, super dope. Has like a silver Alma Manier like on the inside. Then has like this little dust package, um, little, like little cloth that's like the Alma Manier color, that burgundy color. They came out with a white version of these like a couple years ago. I think it was like 2020. And they're going for like 400 bucks right now. So it just kind of shows you how Alma Manier's age over, well over time. But let me go ahead and look at them. Boom, first look at these. Oh yeah, it smells very good. These are this definitely good quality, like leather and stuff, but this is a woman's shoe, like I said. Well, I'm gonna have to set, set the box somewhere because this is kind of getting a little out of hand, but um, yeah, damn. Okay, it has a little Nike Air hang tag, on my manier little hang tag. As y'all can see, first look at these. I have not seen these in person yet. Pretty dope. <sighs> yeah, these definitely smell like some leather, definitely nice. Um, leather quality is pretty nice on these. Has like the black leather. It's a nice Jordan 3. Honestly, I used to love Jordan 3s when I was younger, but Jordan threes now they're very and eh, they're they're pretty nice this certain ones this one's definitely a nicer one though this is definitely a clean Jordan three very wearable like very easily to wear it has that like the almondier burgundy color on the top with that like high quality kind of like um, leather type with those like you know like good like breathing holes then on the back obviously Nike Air that's the best back hold on I'm gonna get a thumbnail I'm gonna do that then though um, super dope pair though Nike Air on the hang tag almondier on I really like how has that A for the almondier logo on the tongue super dope and then. Um, let me look at the other pair real quick. All right, bet we tune back in this video. Super dope. The other pair has the Jumpman logo on the tongue. Uh, hold on a sec. Let me look at the other pair. And then it has like that gray, like fuzziness, like kind of like suede almost. I think it's like kind of like a suede. Yeah, it's definitely like a suede. And then it has like that all right here. This is like literally like they made a white version of these. Like I'm gonna pop them on the screen. They were in like 2020, I think they came out. So it's literally the black version of those. I don't know if those were a brick when they first came out, but right now I'm gonna pop a market on these. They're definitely bricking, but before like prior when they came out i could tell that they weren't gonna do too crazy because when I, like before they came out they were going for like 354 which isn't that crazy for all mom and i feel like all mom and ears usually do go for like five six hundred dollars like prior to release but yeah definitely nice like that diamond stitching on the inside definitely a dope pair definitely easy to wear okay and then boom on the inside this looks cool i think it has extra laces so that's pretty dope little feature it has extra laces what color are these extra laces okay that's like a it's like a grayish um, grayish color for the extra laces so it does come with extra laces 
Then the insole is super dope. It has like Alma Manier like all over. It's gonna be hard to see on the camera, but it has like the Alma Manier logos, like like monogram, kind of like Louis Vuitton has like the monogram, like you know all over, like that pram the LD, kind of like all over of the Alma Manier logo, which is super dope. I would give this pair on a, a like scale one to ten. I would give this pair a seven point five. It is super nice, like definitely really wearable. I did I did I did get it my personal size, so stay tuned for on feet review. I might do that, but we'll just have to see. Because honestly, I have the Jordan Four. I have the Jordan Four bread reimagines, which is like an all black pair, and I love the breads. I couldn't pass on these. This is a size twelve and a half. You know, it's kind of um, I kind of like low key wish I just kept them dead stock, but I do have an extra twelve and a half that's dead stock because this shoe right here, this is gonna age well. This is gonna go good on the market, but these are pretty much VNDS. I've worn them, like I've actually wore, worn them pretty hard and they're holding up, they literally look like brand new, like VNDS. But yeah, I already have like an all black Jordan 4 and I prefer fours over threes, but this is definitely a nice three. So if you are a three person, these are actually really cheap right now. And if you didn't get them for retail, yeah, if you didn't get these for retail though, uh, yeah, they're really cheap right now. They're literally going for retail. Size 10 is under retail right now. I don't know who's selling their pairs for under retail. That's crazy. That must be backdoor action because uh, after fees and stuff i got um this pair on the social status raffle so i think it was like 250 or 245 after taxes and everything which is pretty crazy but yeah it has like that off-white like sole like all, it's not like white but it's kind of like a creamy type sole definitely nice in the bottom pretty nice got the alma manier color then that nike classic jordan 3 bottom nothing too crazy but this is definitely a super clean jordan 3 especially to be a woman's shoe i could definitely see like you know some like this like a lot of women like pulling off the shoe guys can pull off the shoe too though it's the very like this is very um what's the word um what is it called uh you uh you, i think it's called unisex yeah this is definitely like a unisex pair like you know it can be man or woman because this is like all black so you know definitely looks kind of manly but you know girls can girls who like black uh stuff could definitely rock these but it is literally a woman's shoe so obviously they can rock it but yes sir dope shoe nothing too too crazy um i'm gonna I'm see if i want to tow my other pair looking at these i think i don't know that's gonna be hard like they look good right there on like my shelves but i already have like a black jordan 4 like i said so i already have like a black shoe so i don't really need another one plus 12 and a half is going for a little bit right now so um hold on, on the tongue though has like some cool details i was um hearing from people that has cool details oh it looks like it has two such extra laces so it has one more set of extra laces which is a cream color as you can see so it comes with two sets of extra laces which is pretty dope you know that's always good to have um have shoes that come with extra laces that's always good detail that jordans do so that's super dope um that always makes like the shoe like 10 times better and then on the back of the tongue tag has like all mom and near all over the tongue dope tongue the tongue's pretty like high quality has like that cool leather type material super dope shoe honestly definitely very easy to wear look at the nike airs together on the back hold on keep that that's super dope damn like i would actually i could definitely i would definitely wear these but i'm watching my personals right now i'm just trying to cop shoes that i would definitely wear whenever those olive those new olives come out those medium olive travises that's going to be hard for me to pass on especially if i get them for retail but i think uh if i cop them for retail i mean that'd be hard not to wear them but um we'll just have to see whenever those come out how they, good they look in person but damn i'm, I'm near did y'all like this is a little bit bad factor defect right here it looks like someone literally tried on my pair look at that looks like someone literally tried on my pair and ran down the block and he's like <laughs> all right we tune it back in but yeah literally looks like someone ran down the block on this pair i don't know if y'all can see that it has like those glue type i don't know what that is if that is like a factory defect but super clean pair i'm not gonna like ramble too much about this pair it has that cool black and then it fades into the um off white on the sole which is super clean really nice pair night gear on the back these definitely look oh it says on the tongue too work harder so that's it i like that little um little slogan right there it says work harder which is you know that's pretty hard um so yeah it says on both pairs on the tongue like the i don't know what that's called like the lace uh and like whatever the end of the laces so that's pretty cool little touch definitely nice pair definitely some pretty um good quality leather nothing too too crazy but definitely pretty nice let me compare it to the jordan 4 brother imagine real quick okay back comparing comparing the leather quality i expect all my maneers have better leather quality just because it's a, like an all my maneer collab which all my maneer collabs they always do pretty good on the you know quality i'm pretty sure okay all my maneer leather is probably better but they look very similar but yeah tune it back into this video definitely a clean clean pair nothing too too crazy i think if i went with these black laces you can't go wrong with black laces but i feel like the cream laces would look really good on this pair um even these like little alma manier type color like burgundy type laces would probably go in here but i think i do the black or the cream laces so yeah good little suggestion right there but yeah cool little, um has that back tag right there nothing too too crazy dope pair 
Um, I'm trying to see, like, I'm gonna look at market real quick on these. Okay, yeah, boom, this is crazy. They're literally going for under retail right now. I'm looking at my size. I'm gonna probably pop up market if I didn't already. Retail is 250, buy now is 251. A last sale was 251, which is crazy, but in my size, 12 and a half men's, that's like the best size. I think that's going for the most money right now. Last sale was 270. So I probably will flip my pair whenever I get it in hand. I got it on the Amon Manier website. Literally, that was the first size to sell out on the Amon Manier website because I really want these for the personal, but now I'm looking at them. I'm just like, it's just like a nice black Jordan 3. I'm not too much in need for a Jordan 3 unless it's like a super dope one, which this pair is pretty nice, but, um, I don't want to sound like a hype beast for now, but they're, they're not really going for nothing right now. Like everyone's going to be having these, you know, which nothing wrong with that, but it's not even just because that I just like, I'm not like the biggest fan of this colorway. Like, no, I actually, I do like this colorway, but it's just not that crazy. Like it's, it's pretty mid. Let's be honest. It's pretty mid. It's nothing like, you know, I'm trying to watch my personals, but definitely uh pretty, I wouldn't say too comfortable. And so kind of feels a little tough, but probably when you break it in, it's probably pretty comfortable. But yeah, I'm looking forward to other releases this year. This was a pretty cool little release. They have the Jordan 4 on my mirrors coming out soon. I'm going to pop those on the screen. I'm not the biggest fan of those. I like these better than the Jordan 4s that are coming out. I'm not going to lie. I like how it has the Nike Air on the back. I know those have the Nike Air on the back too. But I mean, I just don't like the color way on those. It's like a weird, like pink, like light pink tie color way. I could be tripping. But yeah, definitely a nice pair. Drop a like, drop a sub if you made this far in this video. I appreciate you. And um, yeah, okay. uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button with notification bell. Not miss no fire videos. Got a lot more heat on the way. But yeah, I think that's all the details I pretty much had to go over on this pair. Let me look. Is there anything else on the box or anything I want to go over? Well, it seems like that's kind of it. Uh, they shipped out this pair pretty quick, social status. I'm going to be looking for my pair from Amon Manier here soon. And I might try them on just to try them on to see how they look on feet. But yeah, definitely a nice pair. Definitely very wearable. I see a lot of people rocking these super dope pair but kind of mid let's be honest so i mean i'm not really gonna i don't think i'm gonna personalize them whenever i get my personal size in because yeah like i said it's pretty mid but pretty still like a classic shoe pretty classy you know could definitely wear it to dinner or really anywhere definitely nice uh yeah so i think that's really all i had to talk about in this video on the lace tag it has like the alma oh, manure in the inner kind of it's a dope little pair i already said this oh it's kind of like a weird feeling material on the back but that black that feels weird it feels like not painted it almost feels like styrofoam almost like kind of like feels like different like not rubber how like on the bread reimagine on the bread reimagine the back is like kind of like a harder plastic of that right there but on this pair it's kind of like a kind of feels weird like almost like foamy but yeah oh hold on a sec but yeah i think i went over all details on the shoe peak game really nice pair i haven't really showed y'all up close details I made this far in this video you're gonna see the up close details i might do it on feet on these we'll see if i ch uh, choose to uh personalize my pair whenever i get them in hand but yeah, i already went over that furry on the um top of like kind of like the toe box the, out the outer of the toe box but yeah pretty dope pair drop a like drop a sub hit the notification bell and i think that's all i had to talk about in this video so yeah peace